just reading through my book of our mind guru from my book. Every other paragraph, every other page, he keeps asking. Ask yourself, who am I? And in every point when he asked this question, I kept answering to myself. I am a wife. I am a mother. I am a daughter-in-law. I am a daughter. I am a sister, friend, laundry cook, trainer, teacher, tutor, facilitator, coach, and the answers were endless. And the next point came in my mind. Oh, I play so many roles in so many areas of my life, and I was not aware of. But how do I manage it? How do I balance it? Do I really balance it? And then my thought came like, how do I go about through the day? And this thought kept took me back to my childhood days of this very person who used to come down to my room corner and exhibit his acrobatic things. A person who used to come with his team and climb over a long thread and walk through it, a single thread with no support, just a small stick around and walk through it. How would he balance it? There was just trust and belief in him that he need to balance. That created a balance for him to move from one end to another. The trust and belief to do can take us far ahead. And then I was thinking, how else can we manage? The point which came up again was, point of respect and value. Respect and value for whom? To myself, my space, my time and my people around. Be it professional life, be it personal life or be it social life. If I can value and respect my time, my space and my people around, then I can balance it out very easily. And most importantly, before the start of the day, I need to plan and prioritize what I need to do. If I can plan my day, this part of my day is only for professional life, this part of my day is my personal life, and this part of my day is for my social life. Or maybe a days would come when I'm only professionally involved or only personally involved. But if I've planned appropriately and given prioritizing of which to come first and last, then I can surely balance out my life. And the last which comes is B squares, determination and delegation. If you're determined that I can and I will manage through the day of my planning and exhibit saying you can do it. And if possible, if you can delegate some part of your work where your need is not necessary to people around, you can always balance out your life. Many points to come, balancing your life is an art Enjoy this art because it makes you a wholesome in all areas of your life. Thank you very much. This is your Anuradha Jayachandra from Zone 14 JCI Bangalore Horizon for JCI Bilal Koppa.